Well, hello, my friend, and welcome to my channel. Today, I've got 4th of July with Zoya's Waverly in China, and I'm going to stamp a flag design on it. Here is China. It's a beautiful pixie dust, of course, in red. And then this one is Waverly pixie dust, and it is very pretty blue. And we're going to go in. I'm doing my pinky and my ring finger in blue, and then my other fingers are going to be done in red. And I just love the application of these pixie dust. They just, to me, they're just so easy to control. And I don't make too bad of a mess, which is always nice. I am capping my ends. But we do have a little dot. We gotta break out the orange wood stick. There we go. And you can tell the difference between my ring finger, where it's so wet looking and shiny, and how it dries down to just beautiful blinginess. Of course, you know, I know a lot of people have trouble with texture, so these are just magical when you put top coat on them, in my opinion. And today I'm going to show you both ways. We're going to start off textured and we're going to end up glossy. And the first layer of red is down. Now we're going to go in with our second coat of each. And my camera is struggling between the blinginess of the polish, it's just, I mean, we'll get a second of good looking at it and then blurry, so I apologize. Be very careful, staying, staying on the nail. I really don't like cleaning pixie dust polishes off of my fingertips, but that just deepened that up and made it more opaque and, in my opinion, just beautiful. And I'm doing kind of thin coats. I'm not just glopping it on there because I wanted this to dry down and you know so that I could do my stamping <laughs> without messing it up because I am going to stamp on it before I top coat it. Sorry, there we go. Alrighty, beautiful. I'm going to be using this Cheeky Plate CH4 and the Nicole Diary NS01 Stamping Polish, my Bundle Monster Monocle Stamper, and my Fabio Nail Scraper. And I'm going to use these little stars on the blue nails. And to be honest with you, I could totally dig a manicure with just wearing that blue polish and those white stars. That would just be awesome. And now I'm going to go, <clears throat> excuse me, now I'm going to go in with some wavy stripe lines to represent my flag. And I'm going to put this design on all of my red fingernails. Give it that waviness. I could have done straight lines, but I was being a little rebel today. I decided to get all wavy with it. Make sure I've got it lined up good. And kazoink, there it is. Pat it down for any of the standing up pieces. And I am going to go in with my little tape and try to get as much. There's hardly not any there, but I am going to get that all cleaned up before I um, do any anything else. And I think these look really groovy in the textured look. I really do. I think that they look awesome. Of course, you know, the stamping would not stay like this because, you know, stamping just wants to wash off and peel off. So I am going to take a swatch photo of it in the textured form. And then I will also do one in the glossy version, the way I ended up wearing it because I had to seal those stars and stripes in. That cleaned up like a dream. And here is my swatch photo of the textured and with it glossy. So I would love to hear what you think about this one. Leave me a comment down below. Thanks for watching and until next time, be good to yourself. Talk to you soon. Bye.